Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome, I'm glad you were able to join us. For those who are in the UAE, good evening, and to everybody, Ramadan Kareem. Even in these very challenging and very unpredictable times, the spirit of Ramadan is still with us. And if anything, the importance of gathering together as a community is greater than ever before. There is a long established tradition of coexistence in the UAE that has been shaped by centuries, lived and promoted by our late founding father. The UAE commemorated the death of Sheikh Zayed anniversary yesterday on the 19th of Ramadan. More than six million five hundred thousand people visited the mosque last year not only to see the beauty of the mosque or the architect but also to understand the message the vision that uh, the founding father sheikh zayed uh, had laid for the whole nation message of tolerance coexistence acceptance during these unprecedented times, it is important to focus on our common humanity. Regardless of our different backgrounds, races, and religions, life has truly brought us this shared human experience. The United Nations Alliance of Civilization is committed to continue working on fostering interface dialogue and promoting mutual respect and understanding among all people, regardless of their cultural, religious, race, or gender. I love being um, in the UAE during Ramadan. I love the uh, sanctity of the fasting during the day and the festivity of the evenings. And um, in that spirit, um, the Jewish community uh, here in the UAE is joining so many other faith communities in the UAE in praying for God's mercy. It's encouraging to me that even in this unique moment, you know, this, this uh, moment unprecedented in all of our experiences, uh, you've still managed to convene us. You have brought us together. And uh, more and more, I, I think of Abu Dhabi as sort of the Switzerland of religion. And that the act of prayer itself doesn't simply end with the prayer, but let it trigger a return. What we have seen in this pandemic is we have seen some incredible uh, aspects of humanity, seeing the goodness of the human condition. I've concluded that whether it's a pandemic like Corona or global issues like climate change, there is no way we'll be able to tackle those challenges with a national effort or even a group effort. There is no one country or group of countries that can tackle these issues and actually overcome them. Whether it's Corona, the next pandemic or climate change, what I hope Corona teaches us is that we all have to work together. 